What's good? It's your boy, LC Josh, back at it again with another video early this morning. All the information dropped for Super Saiyan 3 Goku. Uh, Boo, also, the uh, I'm pretty sure the Spice Game Future units. I haven't seen any of their information. Also, I haven't seen any of their actual... <sighs> their animations i want to see those because i'm pretty sure those are going to be first down through here so we're going to go ahead and take a look at all this one if you guys are new to the channel you like what you see subscribe turn on notifications where you get notified when we go live and put up more videos uh, like i said it's about 5 a.m in the morning for me eastern time when i'm seeing this so uh this video might be out like pretty early i'm going to assume it's going to be out pretty early like right after this get it out you know so you know hit the like button help your boy out now let's get into this Oh, they got naked Goku. Okay. I'm still not used to this form just to get All right. All right. Damn. I ain't gonna lie, he's giving him the hands. Yeah, this is pretty much like right out from the anime too. Oh! Oh, you got a counter? Ooh, I didn't know that. <laughs> I don't have much time left to give. <laughs> didn't know that. Now or never. Okay. Okay. Um. Super Saiyan 3 Angel Goku's animations, low key kind of, kind of spicy, not not like holy crap, not not holy crap level, but they kind of spicy. Uh, the next one should be Boo. I don't know why Boo was already started, but all right. Yeah, yeah, I figured Boo's was gonna be him uh, coming out to the little cocoon thing. Boy, Boo, I hope Boo's nasty. Wait, this ain't part of the, um, uh... is this an active skill? What? Wait, what? Oh, he's got a revival. Maybe that was the active skill. And then this is a revival. So far, I kind of like booze a little bit more. And I love the way he's boo boo screaming boo like an anime. I, I love that. Oh, yeah, this is definitely super tight. Yo, hey, yo, I, I I feel like Boo's got the spicier uh, animations. Like for real, for real, I think Boo's got the spicier animations. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not hating on this. I I actually think Boo's got the spicier animations. Let me know in the comment section below which one you think has the best uh, animation so far. Oh, we got a, a Gotenks. Hold on. We get a lot of Gotenks, man. A lot of Gotenks. So, real real talk, I'm hopefully hoping that this one is some kind of um, supporter as well, too, for Gotenks. Hmm? Oh, we got another pure evil? Oh, he's got a, a counter. They're all on Kamehameha category, too. Uh, hold on. Okay, so Spicy and Future Gotenks and Spicy and Future Evil, uh, Pure Evil Boo. Uh, Given the update to the other SCR one that we got, it, we ain't got one since the uh, tech one that was just both uh, Pure Evil and Good Boo in it. Uh, that's... I'm, I'm feeling... If he's physical, too, or something like... If boy... 
don't even get me started if, if he's physical or anything like that. Because like I said, it's going to be very boo dominant. And since we're about to get into the actual uh, stats of it, of everything, which like I said, if you uh, stuck around for this one and you watched me have something stuck in my eye right there. Uh, but if you stuck around for this one so far, we get to see all the uh, Dokkan information of actually how good these units are going to be. I um, appreciate that. So let's see. Okay, so Super Saiyan 3 Goku is first. Uh, let me do that. And, oh, oh that's that's going to be like very, very, very tiny for you all. Uh, actually, that's still very tiny for me. Uh, I, might, I might just switch this uh, back around really quick in real time. Hold on. Because that, that's that's still like incredibly uh, tiny there for me. Let me do, let me, uh, yeah, let me do this. And then let me take uh, this scene off. And hopefully that's uh, helped you out just a little bit as well, too. So we have uh, Majibu Saga for Goku, Majibu Saga and uh, Otherworld Warriors or Accelerated Battle Category. Three key, 170 across the board, plus an additional 30 uh, to Kamehameha and Time Limited category. Interesting right there. Interesting. Um, well, I already see greatly raises attack and defense again for the it's, I, instant transmission media crunch. Okay, I already I already see that, so I already know that that's going to be absolutely pretty good. I just don't know if we have the uh, Dokkan uh, website. I don't know if they. Oh yeah, they don't they don't have them uh, popped in uh, just yet. I figured they would have been like data downloaded in or something like that, but they are not. So uh, activates the interest animation once only chance of performing. A critical uh, hit 50% for five turns from the character's entry turn and reduced damage received by 90% upon the character's entry turn. And with each time pass, damage reduction rate minus 15%, no more than 90%. So basically, he's going to lose it all. But what is that, like six turns? I think. Yeah, 15, 15, uh, 30. 15 15 60 50. yeah 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 so uh so for six turns my goodness can i can i go ahead and see if i can uh pop this up a little bit more no i no i cannot jeez man i want to make this a lot bigger but i can't really all that much but damn so far he's he's okay damage reduction if there's another Majibu psycho category ally on the team Upon the character's entry, key plus two and attack and defense 150 150 percent plus an additional attack and defense 150 percent when performing a super attack. Reduced damage received by five percent with each super attack performed up to thirty percent. Okay, so basically, that's not that's not terrible because in the beginning long run, you're really just gonna keep having a thirty percent and then you'll just lose like fifty. So basically, really, he's getting a hundred and twenty percent. Uh, damage reduction, but seeing as after that first turn, it's just going to start going down. But like I said, the more super attacks you, you land with them or do, like, I mean, it's sort of canceling it out for a little bit. Like, you'll just end up having 30% damage reduction on the card so far. That's not terrible. Medium chance of performing a crit hit. Launches an additional attack that has a great chance of becoming a super attack. Yeah, like, he, he's going to be dummy. So that's two, basically. Three, really, if you count... The hidden potential system and that's just so far currently what i see right now uh 15 percent um damage reduction off three super attacks yeah that's that's not terrible at all uh when there's another machibu saga category ally attacking in the same term plus an additional defense 100 and guards all attacks and uh, as a first attacker in the turn and a dam an additional damage uh, excuse me additional attack 100 percent and launches an additional super attack that, as a second or third attacker in the turn. High chance of nullifying key base attacks, obviously, and directed at the character and countering with tremendous power. I love that they're bringing back to countering with tremendous power because that's one of the things of like in today's current meta and stuff like that that we have, especially with the super attacks and how good these units have been. The counters are going to be ridiculous. And let's let me not. I'm just gonna say this. If Kid Buu, like I said, I've been I've been saying this. If Kid Buu, the physical one, gets a super easy A, and they surprise us in Golden Week, and also give us the freaking Super Vegito, the AGL one, or the physical that get a super easy A, which would probably be the agility one, just because he's the older of the two. 
I, I'm, I'm telling you right now, redonkulous, redonkulous power uh, that would be happening. Active skill uh, can be activated when there's another Majin Buu Saga category. Uh, ally attacking in the same turn from the fourth turn from the start of battle. That's not bad at all, uh, especially with Super Saiyan 3s and stuff like that. You'll be, definitely be able to do that. Master of the Race attack temporary causes ultimate damage to the enemy. And within uh, the turn activated, all attacks become criticals. Ooh. Ooh, at the fourth turn, especially at the fourth turn where he's still getting uh, the damage reduction. And by then, you should have your 30% damage reduction built in. Yeah, he's he's really, really, really good. Not going to lie, you can see the categories that he's all in. And like I said before, greatly raises attack and defense. Uh, for one turn, it causes immense damage and a high chance of stunning the enemy. Uh, I don't know if you're going to be able to get that stun in a lot of the hard events. Um, honestly, at, at this point, if they do break some hard events in and allow you to still stun, then he's going to be incredibly good. But if not, then it's sort of a waste and it's only going to be good for like the lower tier events. But in the hard events, you're really going to be looking for more attack or defense down, depending on which one of the hard events actually let you do that. That's what you're really going to be doing is was wanting to see attack and defense down. So... Uh, he's actually really, really, really good, but I'm low-key hoping that uh, Boo is so much better. Uh, I, I really am. I'm hoping that this man is so much better. So let me go all the way back because, you know, Boo? Oh, 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 that's right. He's he's extreme intelligence, which I called that he's either going to be one of them. And Goku is H oh, AGL. Wow, okay. Um, okay, uh, caught me off guard on that one. Not going to lie there. Uh, bro, there we go. So let's let's get into this. So let's see if you're going to be absolutely incredibly busted. So uh, Majin Buu Saga category, sworn enemies or story figures, three key, 170, plus an additional 30 to the characters that also belong in Worldwide Chaos and Resurrected Warriors. Okay. Uh, activates the interest animation, what's only, and recovers, okay, 10% of HP at the start of characters attacking turn. For the rest of the battle, I can already see where this is going, and I can already say right now with um, with great, and, excuse me, there we go, with great um, foreshadowing here that he's going to be uh, discussing. I can already see it because he's already recovering ten percent HP, and then you got to think about all the actual boosts currently right now that when they link up, they're literally giving. Uh, they're regenerating again. So, I mean, Boo, in, in my opinion, the Boo team was like the team that you ran back in the day when like you just didn't want to die, really, because you were just regenerating HP, HP, HP over and over each turn coming in. Yeah, like, yeah. So let's, let's see how this is going to go. Uh, for the rest of Battle Recover, an additional attack, excuse me, additional HP of 10% for five turns from the character's entry turn. When there's an, another Majin Buu Saga category ally on the team upon the character's entry. Yes, okay, so basically you're getting 20% uh, HP back each time. Yeah, you're not gonna die. Uh, real talk, you're not gonna die with all of the boosts linking together and stuff like that, you're not dying. Uh, you're, you're really not dying. If you can, if you have a lot of Majin Buu's right now in the game, you're not dying. I, I, I'm telling you that right now. Uh, if you die, it's it's on your own accord. Maybe you weren't paying attention for something like that. But real talk, if you're paying attention in the game, you're not you're not really dying. I, I'm just gonna be honest here. Um, yeah, yeah, Majin Buu Saga category. Let's see. Key plus two in attack and defense. A hundred and yeah, 150 plus an additional attack and defense. 150 percent when performing a super attack. So 300 and two key, and you're getting 20 percent uh, HP recovery each turn plus whatever you're getting with the orbs and also with the link. Jeez, man. Um, yeah, launch an additional attack that has a great chance of becoming a super attack. Guards all attacks when HP is, uh, is that 50%? Yeah, 50% or more at the start of turn. Uh, it recovers 10%. I'm sorry, what? Recovers 10% of HP at the end of the turn. And if HP is 30% or less at the end of the turn, recovers an additional 10% of HP. Uh, revives with HP, with full HP recovered when a character is KO'd. Survives KO attacks. Uh, whoa, uh, whoa, up to once within a turn. Oh, yeah, you're not dying. If he gets it, yeah, you're not dying. You're not dying. You're not dying. You're not dying. Um, 
plus an additional attack and defense 100 percent guards all attacks and launches an additional super attack uh, starting from the turn in which the character or allies revival skill is activated recovers hp with sweet treats you're not dying uh in my opinion and this is my opinion alone you could agree or disagree with me but from currently where i'm sitting where i just read this i don't need no damn showcases or anything like that they're they're definitely good but boo is better boo is 100 percent better his team is going to be better uh especially since we're getting uh buhan easy a oh yeah oh oh yeah like absolutely dummy wild and i haven't even seen what the other two are going to be doing and with this uh active skill massively raises attack temporarily causes ultimate damage to the enemy and delays a single targeted enemy's attack for one turn uh changes all key spears to cookies and for one turn key plus 12. recovers hp for sweet treats you're not dying i said this before you're you're literally not dying you're you're not dying oh my man infinite regeneration like golly boy you're not dying raises defense and greatly raises attack for one turn and causes immense damage to the enemy yeah you're not dying up uh, boo high levels Hi, hi. Matter of fact, Boo, I, I want to change it to pink just for you. I want to change it to pink just for you. I'm, I'm definitely going for Boo first, 100%. Uh, going for Boo first. Uh, like I said, Gotenks, I'm hoping that Gotenks is just really a supporting, like he doesn't have to do massive, massive, massive amount of damage, but I'm hoping that he is some kind of rendition of support because uh, if he is, then yeah, it, he, he'll be nutty for uh, the Gotenks team. The Gotenks, go. So the Goten Trunks Gotenks team will be absolutely nasty, uh, 100%. By the way, I know this video is long. It's already been 17 minutes. If you haven't already subscribed to the channel, I greatly appreciate you subscribing to the channel. I greatly appreciate you listening to all the info that we've been getting currently right now for the units and stuff. I greatly appreciate you watching this video for a long time, whether it's in the background or not. Appreciate you. So hybrid say is I already see is 3Q and 130. Uh, oh, I see. Massively raises attack and defense for one turn and causes supreme damage. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, hold on. Hold on. He might cook. Uh, attack and defense 177%. All right. That's just right off the bat. That's no need to super attack or anything. He gets that. Okay. A great chance of key plus seven plus an additional attack and defense 77% for when performing a super attack. Interesting. Um, interesting. Launches an additional attack that has a great chance of becoming a super attack. Okay, great chance of evading enemies' attacks includes super attacks for seven turns for the character's uh, entry turn. That's really good if he's on the second or the third rotation and you already have your rotation sort of uh, figured out and put in for your slots. If he comes in on the third turn, uh, that's actually going to be very good. I'm not going to lie to you. That's going to be very, very good because then that's seven turns additionally that you will get uh, from him evading in like the last slot because that's what you're probably going to run him off currently right now since again the transforming super saiyan 3 gotenks is already so good and then the uh super easy a gotenks as well is really good uh i'm gonna assume the third slot is what oh, i already see third attacker as well second or third attacker yeah i know what i'm talking about i already know what i'm talking about uh so uh, what I leave a fat high chance of yeah, for evade for seven turns, uh, starting from the eighth turn from the start of character's entry, plus an additional attack of even 77% as a second or third attacker in a turn. Yep, yep, that's, that's where he's gonna live. He's gonna live in the floater spot. Or if you don't already have those other units, then he's probably gonna be in the second uh, slot or something like that, which he'll still eat in the second slot clearly. Uh, as a second or a third attacker, plus an additional attack of defense, 20% up to 77 with each attack evaded. Yep. Uh, plus, uh, and that still goes for super attacks. Uh, chance to perform a crit hit plus 20% up to 77 with each super attack performed. Yeah, he's going to be good. He's 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 going to be very good as well, too, uh, on the team. Massively raises attack and defense. Oh, I thought that only said massively. Oh, what am I? Oh, my gosh. Massively raises attack and defense. Oh, my goodness gracious. Uh, for one turn, cause supreme death. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he's. Okay. 
Uh, oh, okay. Uh, he, he's, he's, he's disgusting. And this is going with, they still didn't show us for, again, part two, because there's always going to be, going to be a part two for this one. I'm hoping for part two, we get a legendary banner that has two LRs on it. And if that happens, I really want it to be Ultimate Gohan LR, standalone Ultimate Gohan, and Kid Buu. I'll take both of them right then and right now. Kid Buu don't even have to be a Doe Confess at this point. A Kid Buu would be redonkulous. That's all I'm going to say. That is all I'm going to say. So he's tech. Wait, what were you again? Were you? Oh, that's right. You were physical. Uh, so he's tech. Uh, Majibu, uh So Maja Power 130. Uh, yeah, 130. So key plus one. Attack and defense 40%. Huh? Uh, and a chance to perform a crit hit. And chance to evade enemies attacks, including super attacks, plus 10% per Majin Power uh, category ally on the team. And if all the allies is in the Majin Power category, launch it. Wait. And if all allies are in, oh, Majin Power category, launch an additional super attack to that. And all attacks become crit hit. Oh, hell no. Hell no. Hell no. Uh, okay, become crit hits. All right. Plus an additional attack of even 60% when performing a super attack. Plus an additional uh, attack 60% if HP is 60% or more when attacking. Recovers 5% of HP at the start of turn. Yeah, you're not. You're, you're not. You're not dying. Uh, recovers an additional 5% HP when HP is uh, 80% or less at the start of turn. Oh, yeah. And recovers an additional 10% of HP when HP is 40% or less at the start of turn. Uh, survives KO attacks. That's two. That's two. Okay. Survives KO. Wait, wait. Um, if I'm not mistaken, I'm pretty sure uh, Maju. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Maju survives KOs as well. Okay. I, 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 if I'm not mistaken... I might have to go back and brush up on it. I might been I might have been wrong here. I might have been wrong, but I want to say I think he survives KOs. Yeah, that's how that's how you get his uh, revival or something like that, or his active skill. Uh, uh, hold on, I could be wrong. I, I got to go back and do my research on that one. I might try to put that in uh, after um, this video or something like that. If I was wrong, but I might have to go back and check that again because ooh, ooh, hold on, hold on. Uh, forty percent or less, or survives KO. Uh, up to once uh, within a turn. Oh, I'm sorry, what? Survives KO attacks up to once within a turn? When HP is... It, I, am I... Am I tripping? Am I reading that wrong? Is this not is this not processing in my head? Uh, um, Once within a turn? Does that mean you can do this in multiple turns? Multiple turns you can survive KOs? Because you're not dying. You're not dying. What the fuck is this? What the fuck is this? I I, I gotta be tripping. Let me know in the comment section below. I gotta be tripping. I I, I I have to be tripping on that one. There's no way. There there there's no way that that's what that is. Um, when HP is forty percent or, or more, high chance of oh oh okay okay, uh, attacks uh, up to once when HP is forty percent or more. Okay okay, wait attacks. Yeah, survive KO attacks when HP is 40% or more. Uh, within what? I'm tripping. I, I gotta be. I gotta be. Hot chance of nullifying key based attacks directed at the character encountering with tremendous power recovers HP with sweet treats. I gotta be tripping on this on this unit. That ain't no way. Because Majin, I, I said it before and I'll say it again. I think Majin team just shot right back up in the top tier. Like right back up into top 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 tier and like i said if that kid boo gets a super easy a if the physical kid boo gets a super easy easy a it's over with it is 100 percent over with i promise you this team will be absolute disgusting margin margin team is going to be one of the most dangerous teams to literally run um in the game like if you're if you're a newbie i would recommend a margin category for you right now if you are a newbie to this game and you want to have fun in this game and play it for a long time and dominate still i highly recommend you summon for boo good boo fat boo whichever one you want to call it, i'd highly recommend you summon for him because that is nasty 
absolutely nasty. Wow. Wow. Uh, races, oh, massively raises attack for four turns. It causes supreme damage. No. Raises attack for four turns? Oh, hell no, dude. He's, he's, he's good. He is very, very good. Yeah, uh, Majibu all the way for me, just for the simple fact that Majibu is great. Majibu is great. Uh, I, he's 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 solid. He's he's solid. One hundred percent. This video is incredibly long. I probably didn't edit this like crazy or anything like that. So uh, I'm just gonna say, uh, hopefully you did enjoy this all the way through. If you did, hit the like button, subscribe, and turn on notifications where you get notified when we go live and put in more videos. Cause man's old oh, man's. We are in for a good golden week, and this is only the beginning of the golden week, and we haven't got to the part two. And again, this is going to last for a whole month. A whole month. And it's already looking good. But other than that, have an awesome day slash nice day. Stay safe, and I'm out. Peace. <laughs>